Hello everybody, because you're all too busy stretching your snakes at Japanese tentacle porn, I've created One Minute DCS. This time it's Takam Navigation in the Mirage 2000C. On the outer ring there are three Takam modes. Receive, which is direction only, Transmit Receive, which is range and direction, and A for locating tankers. Today we're working with Transmit Receive. The left outer ring sets the band to X or Y. The inner ring select frequency. Turn ILS on using the left outer ring. Use the inner knobs Giggity to set frequency. Set the HSI to Takan. Immediately the large needle will point at the tune Takan set, Batumi in this case, and the range will be displayed. Turn up the volumes for Takan and ILS. In the first leg we're flying out 6 nautical miles away from the Takan set at Batumi. If the arrow is pointing down it means you're flying away from the Takan signal. When you reach the 6 nautical mile mark, change your Takan frequency to match Cobaletti and change your heading to due north. You will see range decreasing, keep flying straight until the station is 90 degrees to your right. Tune the next station and remember the runway heading. Fly until the needle is around 10 degrees from the runway heading and then begin your turn and descent. With the runway ahead, tune ILS, select approach mode and land. Please remember that runway headings are rounded off. Additionally, remember that a Takan station may not always be in line with the runway. It could be at the end of the runway, beside the runway, or stuck up the cooch of the base commander's horny wife. With that inviting thought, I thank you all very much for watching. Please don't forget to dislike or tell me to go fuck myself below.